So this season's been a little bit of a tough one. We went out for elk early on, didn't get anything. The rut started a little after we left there. Been whitetail hunting with a bow and uh, you know, coming close, just not quite, quite sealing the deal, so. It's my last day of uh, whitetail season. And then I head back up for elk next week for eight days. Um, let's see if I can get it done. Uh, put the bow away and broke out the rifle today. So we'll see what's what. And uh, if anything comes out, the big target buck that we've been after in this area, um, unfortunately, is, has been shot by one of the neighbors. Uh, got to... Got to nail it off his porch, I think. So it's one of those things that it happens, you know, a, a deer will leave the property and yeah, it's fair game. We put a lot of, a lot of time and effort into that one though. So we'll see if something else comes in and uh, see if we can close off the whitetail season with a, with a bang. <laughs> up blind right across a uh, little meadow they usually come out on this cut line right across we'll keep an eye see if we can't get something coming through Well, I went ahead and took the shot, dropped him in his tracks. Um, I think he's one of the smaller four by fours that we have on the property. Um, yeah, we'll go over there, see what's going on. Here he is. actually actually a buck we wanted to let live um, but he's not now so anyway this is uh, pretty happy got some meat in the freezer this fella helped feed the family nice healthy deer Yeah, very nice. Couldn't be happier. Awesome. Whitetail season's over for me. Now it's, uh, I go after my late cow draw for cow elk, and I have a mule deer doe draw as well. See if we can get that done next week and uh, close out the season. <laughs>